Well, the show is so good. What are you most enjoying about your character? Oh my god, my character is awesome. She's so grounded and she's so strong and she's intelligent and like thinks about her decisions and isn't afraid to back up her decisions. And I wish I was kind of more like her. So I'm hoping it's going to bleed into my life somehow. But she's incredible and she goes on this amazing journey with. I have such great cast members. They're all of them are so strong, and our writers are in. I mean, Jenny is brilliant. Jenny Ehrman, my creator, is absolutely brilliant. The twists and turns that she has created, the redemption of villainous characters, the the fall of like of the ones that we consider good, because that is the way life is. That is what we live. You know, as much as we try to uh, strengthen our character and strengthen the people that we are, we fall. And as much as people that you know are only living by themselves and only doing for themselves, they have they need love too, and and they and they want to do right too. And so I think that it's a really beautiful play. You get to see this journey, not only Jane's journey, but all the people around her and how they affect her and how that affects life, essentially, and each other's lives. And speaking of the journey of the show, I mean, from one first-generation American to yes, another one, yes. um, there was a lot of pressure to make this show succeed because there have been like yeah. more Ooh. African-American driven <laughs> series than Latino series Latina that succeed. Ladies. So I want to know what, what will set you guys apart? Um, well, I mean, I, I wish all of those series lots and lots of success because I know that the the actors in those shows are going through the same crazy journey that I am, which is you put your heart out there, you expose yourself, you stand there naked just hoping people accept you for who you are and the work that you give out. And so I think that... I, I'm not going to say what sets us, well, what sets us apart is that we have a Latino lead on the CW, which has never been done. High five, Hello, girl. okay? And so, like, but the truth is, is that the story is not specific to just Latinos, because Jane is a type of girl. She's a type A girl. She makes lists, and she has her clothes ready the night before, and she has her plan of how she wants life to look, and she has her wedding dress picked out, you know, when she was the age of four. You know, she is that girl. That's a specific type of girl. It just so happens that they're putting a brown baby in the forefront because the truth is is that Jane is everything and anything. She's every girl, she's every girl and her story is not specific to one ethnicity because the truth is is that there are so many ethnicities and so many cultures that are the first, second, third generation. You know, you can go home and your grandmother speaks, you know, um, Hebrew and you're like right back, yeah, yeah, grand, for sure, grandma. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or she speaks any other language. You know, my, my girlfriend is from Senegal and she goes home and her parents speak French and she speaks in English and I go home and my parents speak in Spanish, and that's it. But there is no difference between um, any culture when it comes down to what you want in life. You want love, and you want success, and you want your dreams to come true. And that story is the human story. And Jane is telling a human story, and it's just being told by a Latino. And it's just kind of about time, because if you put a cover over me and I told you my story, I'm, um, I was a dancer in Chicago, and then I went to NYU Tisch School of the Arts. My sister is an investment banker. My other sister is a doctor. What ethnicity am I? Exactly. You do not know. So it's about time that we start reflecting reality because we are everything. Every ethnicity is everything now. There is no standard. There is no limits. And there are no boxes. So don't try to put me in one because I won't fit. <laughs> and it's comedy I'm so sorry. Language. I have to take her. Comedy is a universal language. And drama is a universal language. We all watch, we watch the arts. We watch fictional reality to be connected to our, our daily reality. And my daily reality is twists and turns and funnies and highs and lows and that is what Jane goes through. She goes through an incredible roller coaster that anybody can relate to and the people around her go through roller coasters as well. So if it's not Jane you relate to, maybe it's my baby daddy, maybe it's my mother, maybe it's my grandmother, maybe it's my father, but they're all so full and they're so well written that you don't have to just connect with me. Watch the show and watch everybody.